What's up, guys? Told you I would uh, make a video. Hopefully, we can get to that uh, those legendaries that I opened in the other one and get to use them. Don't know if that's going to happen, but eh, that'd be cool. So, I made this deck very heavy on the 1s, 2s, and 3s. Uh, on the mana cost of 1, 2, 3, and then really jumps ahead to 6, 8s, 9s, and 10s, which is going to be interesting. It's quite an uneven you know, amount of things there, but... We'll see if, if it pays off in the end here. I should have held that mana until the next round, because now I won't be able to do anything next round. That was kind of dumb, although I can fire at him, but you know, I don't know. Oh, well. So right now I've got... This is great. This is good. Um, a lot of spells right now. i got to get start getting like, enemies out there. More spells. See, that's my problem. It's very spell-heavy. Uh, but that's okay. Mm -hmm. Deal three damage. I guess I should go for the three. So we've done some damage to him. He's done some damage to me. This is going to be a really scrappy deck. It's weird because it contradicts itself. This deck you would think would be made to attack real quick and grind it out fat but fast before you die. But my deck is kind of grinded out. But if the game lasts long enough, I got some big boys coming out. But the middle ground is where I can have some problems. So right now, based on the way the deck is built, I kind of rush built it. So we'll see what happens. I'm going to go ahead and uh, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and play. I'm not going to do any damage. I'm going to play this card and I'll do the four damage. I'll do the six damage next time and I'll protect myself for the next turn while I don't have another move. Oh, it cannot. There's no camera. So, he's probably thinking he doesn't want to attack because he's afraid of what I'm going to do to him. And he's right because I'm just going to gain armor. But attack as he does anyway for one, so that was a pretty good trade-off there. Attack. Can't do anything else. Again, more spells. I really need some cards to drop, like some creatures to drop. Um, but I'll do some direct damage now to him. Probably could have used that turn to draw cards and hopefully get creatures, but I think I've got so much protection right now that I can just start to deal direct damage before he gets started. Hopefully he won't know what hit him and it'll be oh, the game will be over. I mean, that's with the and you won't unfortunately for you guys though you won't get to see my potential legendaries that we opened early because I've got three in the pack right now here he goes because he's dropping creatures down now so something's got to give but this is cool because I can play now oh pyroblast so there's a 10 pyroblast I created that card using after I uh, disenchanted using all those cards I bought so I can do this for two and do all the damage and then still draw the cards that I want to draw. So that's cool. So there he goes. And now I can draw my cards. And there is a legendary right there. Death Rattle, Summon a 4-5, Bane Bloodhoof. Plus he's out there then. Uh, when a minion attacks your hero, destroy it. So we've got some real good setups now for this mage. That I've been playing on here. We'll see what he comes back with now. I haven't done any damage to him that turn. Really. So we'll see what he does with my Protect 4. So I'm at 31 right now, really. 29. And now we rest at 27. And he's got a little bit more left to go. And man, there's, man, Onyxia, or whatever the hell you pronounce it is. I love this one. Look at this. Summon 1-1 one, one whelps until your side of the battlefield is full. So we're going to get to play that, I think. So that'll be really cool to look at that. So we can vaporize. When a minion attacks your hero, destroy it. Uh, we can do, we can do this one. Now yeah, let's do, yeah, let's throw a legendary out here in the blood hoof. So if he dies, he'll put something back on the table for me to try to combat that 
Defias uh, Ringle Leader. And that should offset that. He may do a little bit of damage to me. And depending on what he draws, we'll see what happens. It's going to be a close game, though, I think, by the end of the whole thing when it's all said and done. Destroying an enemy minion. So he did that, took care of that without having to use his... Um, without having to use his card. But, of course, now I've summoned the Bane Bloodhoof. Now he's dealing damage to my Bloodhoof with another card. And that did not kill it, but now he's going to kill it but sacrifice himself. And then deal one damage to me, which is fine with me. And now we have, whenever you play a card, summon a 2-1 Flame of Azanoth. Plus, I have this card out there. Uh, let's see. Mm, we can do a few things here. Alright, well, should I put spells out there? I'm going to put... S eh. I'll put spells out here. I'm going to put the card out. And I'll do the spells after. Let's see what he does now. I have a feeling he's got a couple spells and then a big boy he's going to play soon. We'll see what that big boy ends up being. Well, there's that's not quite the big boy I was expecting, but it's somebody. And then he's going to do one damage to me. That must be all he has. He must be done. And he is done. Wow. Okay, so that's really good for me because I can sheep him on this and attack and then also play one of these spells. And that's what I'm going to do. Exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to sheep him. And of course that creates my flame of Azanoth. And then when a minion attacks your hero destroyed, I can do that. When a enemy casts a spell on a minion summon a 1-3 new target, I'm going to do this spell and of course I'm going to attack and that is we're really in a good position right now I believe let's see has something that wipes out all my minions at this point organ isn't going to help him right now his sheep is going to attack me of course it's not bad that his sheep is going to take the sacrifice because it's just a sheep And now there's the big boy. That's the one we were looking for. I knew he had something like that up his ass. Man, it's cost of 20. Holy crap. Oh, man. So he took out almost everybody on my board right there. So now he's doing some serious... Now he's he's in serious mode. He's, he's going up. He's gearing up. Deal four damage to all enemy minions. So that will take out one of his, but that won't be enough. So here's the card we wanted to play. Let's play it. Battle cry. Summon one one whelps until your side of the battlefield is full. That is freaking awesome. Who shall be next to I just dealt salmon damage to him too, by the way. Uh, I guess I could just. Well, let's just do it. I want to see. Here we go. Let's see what this looks like. This is gonna be cool. This guy's face is going to freak out. Look at that whammo. You are <laughs> that is awesome. Oh man. Oh, you are in trouble, my friend. Destroy all enemy minions unless he has a card like that, he's in trouble. I give up. I give up. <laughs> oh, that is epic. That is great. That was cool, guys. That was fun. <laughs> To open that card in the to open that card in the packs before this game, and then to get to use the card and for that to be the reason why the game ends and the guy offs himself in kamikazes, can't get any better than that. I'm pumped up. Thanks for uh, thanks for watching the game, guys. Click the like button, subscribe, and uh, Spectrum Gaming Six One Seven. I'll see you next time. If my other videos ever load, geez.